to another Loot Crate Adventures. I hope each and every one of you had a very, very happy holidays. I ended up with a pretty nasty cold, but overall, I did get to relax and enjoy my holidays. So overall, this end of the year is turning out very well. My Loot Crate just shifted and I'm so excited because first of all, this is a very big box. Second of all, it's the last Loot Crate box of 2015. Now they went ahead and titled this Loot Crate Galaxy. If some of you are previous looters, then you would know that they have used the name Galaxy before. I'm not quite sure why they use the same name. Maybe they're running out of ideas. If I was them, I would have probably titled it like Galaxy, the next generation. Something. Something with like, you know, so you wouldn't get confused with the other one. Or Galaxy 2. Well, whatever. If you're looking up this loot crate, just make sure you put 2015 so you don't get confused with the previous ones. I did go ahead and look up to see what kind of contents were inside. I did get a few spoilers from other friends, not by looking up what was the contents inside, but they did say there's supposed to be some Star Wars of Force Awakens, and I did go and see the movie, and I love the movie. I'm not gonna give out any spoilers, Go watch the movie for yourself. If some of you out there have not seen it and you're like, hey Panda, uh, should I go watch the previous movies in order to watch this one? I am going to say, no, you're not gonna have to go. You don't, don't go and like torture yourself and binge watch all of them. I mean, you could, that's what we did. We rewatched all of them, like back to back right before we watched the movie. Uh, the main important ones, of course, better Google the main important ones, but if you have never seen any of this Star Wars, what is your life? Uh, I say that you, if you go ahead and jump into this movie, you'll be totally fine. As long as you know the main characters like Chewbacca, Princess Leia, Han Solo, and, and you know the basics, you're fine. All the other people are new characters, none of us know jack squat from them, so don't worry. And I'm definitely not going to give any spoilers because it's just no spoilers. Okay, and so they did say that there was supposed to be something from like Halo and I didn't look too much more into it because I've already got too much spoiled to it. So let's go ahead and open up this box and find out what Loot Crate put together for us for 2015's last Loot Crate box, Galaxy. Off the bat, we start off with a very squishy t-shirt. They did say they're going to go forward uh, on forward with t-shirts. So what do we have here? Of course, it's a galaxy theme and looks very um, 1980s feel. It's got the retroactive um, arcade feel to it. It's uh, not the usual soft materials that they um, that they produce, but that's fine. I'm not exactly sure. So we got all the planets and I see a robot down here. I'm not really too sure and they don't really say and I don't want to look inside the book but if any of you know of this reference, it may just be like a typical galaxy shirt because you know the galaxy themes. It's definitely a galaxy theme. Definitely going on there. Whoa, next one. This this one's huge. This is oh, I can even take this out of the box. I think this one's the whole. Whoa, what? Whoa, what? I think this is pretty much the entire loot crate. Here. What are these con what is it so it's u-n-s-e is it the same on both yeah united nations space command it's a pretty heavy duty lunchbox i do collect lunch boxes what on earth has loot crate put together i opened it up oh man oh they put all this stuff in here wait wait Guys, guys, so inside this lunchbox is more like loot stuff in there. And guys, I didn't know this was going to be in there. Guys, it's the Han Solo. It's a Funko Pop. It's a Funko Pop of Han Solo. Aw, and he's old because in the Force Wiccans, he's old because it's in the... Oh, I can't give any spoilers. I can't get, it's the snow gear. Oh, it's a bobblehead too. I uh, am collecting like a lot of the Star Wars. I don't think, I don't know if I have any of the four. So I have Kylo Ren, I have Kylo Ren, but holy crap. So on the back there's like Princess Leia and Admiral Akbar. It's a trap. Did I say it right? It's a trap, it's a trap. Oh man, there's like some really interesting. They're, they're missing. 
some some really cool characters in this one um but that's so freaking cool now i don't have to go get myself a han solo i really wanted a han solo um and i now i got it i'm really excited this is so cool now i get to add him along with all the other ones i'm really happy he gets to go next to my c3po and my r2d2 and my kylo ren yay all right so next up in oh squishy Ooh. Whoa! Ah, guys! Guys! Do you know what this is? Do you know? Do you know? Do you, you have no idea? You have no. Okay, you do. You do. It's a BB-8 Zuck. It's a BB-8. Oh, I love BB-8. I want a real life BB-8. You have no idea how much I want a real life BB-8. There is this guy in Canada who built a real life BB-8. I'm hunting this guy down, seriously, and I want him to make me one. It took him like six months to make this thing. It's so awesome. Now I got socks. These are so cool. I'm going to have to fight my husband over this. Shit. My husband's totally going to want one. They should have put like, like two. Crap. I need more of these. These are so cute. We're in here. Uh, Galaxy Quest Emblem Patch. Oh, cool! So it's the, uh, so it's another patch. I think in the pr previous, previous Galaxy box, they gave us a NASA patch, and now we have the Galaxy Quest patch. Man, I haven't heard that Galaxy Quest in a really long time. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that, but that's pretty cool for those who actually like patches and those who like Galaxy Quest. And of course, we're down to the very nitty gritty. We've got here... It's an Xbox Halo 5. I don't want to show you because I don't know if there's any codes. Oh, there is a code in here. There's a code. So, there's code on the other side. I'm not quite sure what they give you, but it looks like... It looks like it may be the game? No, no. Maybe it's a, the supply pack. I'm going to have to look at this. I'm not showing you the code. <laughs> We've got our pin, which is the loot crate galaxy they are going with a lot of the gold they must really like gold and of course our booklet that pretty much tells you like all the cool little loot crate things they show you like people who wear like the loot crate items i never take a picture i don't know why i never do and then of course like the items oh the shirt so it's an ugly holiday sweater shirt got it got it did any of you get an ugly sweater i got this sweater i don't think it's ugly it's mickey and it's very cozy. It's got like Mickey and stuff and reindeers on it. Uh, somebody, I think the cashier, he was like, oh, you got yourself an ugly sweater. I'm like, I kind of like it. I think it's cute. Uh, and then for some reason, I think I've seen this box before. Well, I've seen the print on the box. Obviously, I've seen the box before. I've seen the print before. I feel like they used it when they gave us a lot of the, well, that's a Halo thing, but I feel like gave it to us before i don't know so overall i love the han solo i'm really glad i didn't have to go and like search out you know how difficult it is to find funko pops these days because there's assholes out there who buy funko pops and resell them for like triple the amount people are jerks out there resellers are assholes but i'm really happy that i got my han solo i don't have to go and like, give an arm and a leg and a firstborn child for him. Of course, then, of course, I like my BB-8 socks. I'm going to have to fight my husband. This, this baby, this is pretty cool. And he's big enough to actually put food inside. So I kind of like that. I take my lunch boxes to work. Instead of a purse, I take a lunch box of food. How many of you be You're not cool enough to do that. You should. That's a good idea. Overall, the last of 2015 loot crates. I'm really excited to see what's going to come forward. We're going to obviously, every loot crate is going to have a t-shirt. And I really hope they, they give us more Funko Pops so I can add to like my obsession. That'd be really cool. So what were your thoughts on this final loot crate? Was this one for you or were you glad you actually skipped it? I think Loot Crate is doing this new thing where they're going to start reselling individual pieces. So I'm wondering if they're going to resell some of the Funko Pops. If they are, keep an eye out on Loot Crate and see if you can get yourself something. I'm going to see if they have any BB-8 socks because I just, I know my husband's going to fight me on this. I just know I'm going to have to hide this. I'm going to 
have to hide it. But yeah, let me know your thoughts on this if, once again, you guys are interested in Loot Crate. There is a code that I will leave in the description below. It's 10% off. And so your total comes to like $20. And yeah, 2015 is like, we're done. We're done with 2015. Sayonara, I'm kind of glad. I'm ready to say hello to 2016. And I'm pretty excited to say hello to 2016 Loot Crate Boxes. So, thanks for watching, guys. If this is your first time here, hi, my name is Panda. You should subscribe down below because I do post videos about random babblings, tons and tons of reviews, tons and tons of Loot Crate unboxings. And I will see you guys all later. Happy, happy holidays. Happy New Year. Happy 2016. I love you. Thanks for supporting me. I do appreciate it. You guys just, you make my day. You make me glow. I love it. I heart you all. I will see you later. Bye.